E salve galera, beleza? Bem-vindos a mais uma gameplay de The Wolf Among Us Esse é o episódio 4 agora, galera Vamos lá, em Ships Clothing No episódio 3 aconteceu tanta coisa, cara Tanta coisa foda Caramba, foi um episódio muito massa Mas vamos lá, galera, esse é o episódio 4 E vamos dar início Antes de começar esse episódio, eu quero pedir pra vocês É... Eu sei que eu sempre peço e quase sempre peço isso E vocês não vão fazer, mas vamos lá Deixa um comentário no vídeo, pelo amor de Deus Se você não deixar um comentário, um trem vai entrar no cu de sua mãe Acho que talvez desse jeito vocês deixem um comentário Vambora Se você não pode olhar human, você vai para farm It's as simple as that. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. Crane must have taken a shard with him. The open arms. Enjoy your stay. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. Bigby? How could you do this to me? I guess I finally see you for who you are! Tell me who did it! Just tell me who did it! I know you know! I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? Caramba, mano. Esse foi o episódio passado, galera. E episódio foda, episódio passado, hein? business the silver slug deformed and shredded on impact he'll be okay though hmm? he'll be okay his internal organs are positively riddled if I don't extract every single scrap of silver he's liable to suffer some long-term toxicosis nossa mano tem prata no sistema do Big B. Try not to move O braço dele tá quebrado. Eu não posso continuar assim, velho boy. Eu pensei que eu ia ser feito antes de você ser consciente. Mas há pouco que eu posso fazer para a pain. Meu braço. Só deixe-me terminar. Minha arma. Sim, muito feia. Mas não é desesperante. Eu não posso dizer o mesmo para essas bolas que passam por todos os seus vitais órgãos. Por favor, Big B, não se move. Doctor. Olha, eu estou um pouco engajado em salvar sua vida no momento. But if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. Eu vou ter que colocar o braço no lugar eu mesmo. Meu braço. Maluco. Why? Hmm, not bad. That'll do, I suppose. He's lucky to be alive. And he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. He didn't listen to me before. Maybe he'll listen to you. I don't know about that. Well, he should. There are limits to what even I é o trabalho. Do. This is the job. É o trabalho. Quiet. Ossos do ofício. Just relax. Essas coisas acontecem com a gente. Uh, 
Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes to finish with him. I, I think I should stay, at least until he's out of the woods. Believe me, Bigby couldn't be in better hands, and I need the space to work, so if you wouldn't Eu vou ficar mind, bem. we'd appreciate the headroom. Don't worry, Snow. I'll be okay. We'll be down in a moment. Just please, give us the time. Hey, Doc, how much longer? Colin, leave him be. It's finished when it's finished. Because I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in ten minutes flat. <laughs> Colin, you're not even supposed to be here right now. Oh, really? Where am I supposed to be? I'm here to take care of my friend. Não distraia o doutor, Colin. With what? Your hooves? Hey, listen, please, lady. Please, keep it down back there. Thank you. Could you please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open? Yes, that would be helpful. Caramba, mano. <sighs> there. All done. Todos os pedacinhos de, de chilhaço. This isn't a habit you should keep to. Having visits with me. And, well, this time... This time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. É, maluco, o doutor deu ultimato. That's right. Se a gente tomar mais um tiro de bala de prata no coração, fodeu. He knows what it means. It's just been an unusual couple of days. I know, but please, don't give him the excuse. His body will eventually give out. Take care of him, please. I will. He'll need rest, I assume. Sleep mostly. Just keep watch and make sure he doesn't get into further Eu tô aqui. I'm right here, guys. Come Eu tô ouvindo on. tudo. Anyways, guard against, as they say. Miss White, Sheriff, Colin, Swiney. <laughs> So, how do you um feel? Ah, uma cervejinha, o Big B vai voltar ao normal. Okay. Hell, I've seen him take worse. Eu tô bem, eu tô, eu tô bem. Not as good as can be expected, I think. So, not well then. I'm glad you're not dead. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or, or died, I guess. It, um, it kind of scared the hell out of me. I've never seen you like that. And when Swineheart arrived, you know him, he's never worried. Estou aqui and por even você. he thought you were, <laughs> Vou falar pra ela. I don't know, it was just awful. Snow, I'd never leave you. Yeah, you were really fucked up, man. You look like when you take an action figure and bend its limbs the wrong way. Colin... I'm just saying I was worried about him is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, I'll get some rest when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? What's even happening out there? I mean, do you guys have like a plan or something? And who should I be asking? Should I be worried about the Crooked Man taking over? Or is Crane still the thing? The Crooked Man, Bloody Mary, the Tweedles. This is bigger than what I thought it was. Yeah. The Crooked Man came out of the shadows for a reason. For him to attack us so blatantly like that. He either feels invincible or desperate. Well, if those are my two options... I don't think I'd pick Desperate. What do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying, that's not exactly something you do when you're playing with house money. So he called my bluff. It's not like I'm gonna let Bloody Mary just murder him. Ah, mano, ela me salvou, cara. It was a split-second decision, and I don't care how it looked. Obrigado por I'd ter make me it again salvado. and twice on Sunday. Yeah, uh, thanks, Snow, for all that back there. No problem. Thanks? You're not pissed that Crane's flown the coop? Or that the crooked man thinks he's got snow under his thumb? 
We're all mad about it, Colin. But it's not like we have a strong choice pôde. in the matter. What else could Snow do? If she didn't hand him over, my ass would be down the witching well. And Crane still would have been taken. Okay, okay, I'll take your word for it. All I care about right now is... Just what does the Crooked Man want out of this? I thought he was just a loan shark, but clearly he's operating in other circles. It can't just be about Crane, right? Getting him out of town? Is this all about the murders? Crane can't be useful to him anymore. So what could this have to do with Faith and Lily? Crane How long usado. has this stuff been going on? Crane was a puppet. And the Crooked Man worked the strings. This is all about control of Fabled Town. But then what do prostitutes have to do with it? Lily? And Faith? I don't know how it all works out yet, but I know it does. Somehow. The Crooked Man declared war against us last night. At least that's what I thought when it happened. But now I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. We need to do things the right way. What does that mean, the right way? What do you think I mean? I don't know, mm. but it suspiciously sounds like your way. Bigby's the one Ela on the front fazer as lines. Do jeito dela. You can't give him a leash. He doesn't work that way. A little restraint and thought behind things will never que que hurt anyone, Yeah, wait, what do you mean? What is this? right way we haven't been doing a good job you and i so starting now we do everything cut and dried by the book straight as an arrow pure as driven snow i'm not saying i'm the arbiter of sure you're not this town has enough monsters what happened last night what you turned into it can't happen again we need monsters to fight monsters. Colin, if I really believed that we needed him to lose his flippin' mind at a moment's escolha, notice, mano. then that would mean I'd lost tá all faith and our ability to help this town. Just let that side of you be done, Eu okay? Be done and buried and we can all move on. We were under attack, Snow. What did you expect me to do? There are degrees. Degrees? I only ever do what's necessary. Really? Do you believe him? Yeah, I do. Look, Bigby, I care about how this is done just as much as I care about it getting done. So for that, you want to give him a handicap? Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Everybody wants Bigby to smile and shave and take a shower now and then. Hell, I'm practically the president of the Bigby Don't Be Such a Dick Club. Meu but this is the wrong Bigby fucking Sousa, time to put shackles on him. Hold on, who says I'm sloppy? I always do what I do for a reason. And it's all turned out how you planned. He'll get the job done. Just let him do it. I'm going to... I'm going to let you do it, okay? It's just that... Now that I'm deputy mayor, I need your respect. And this situation has to end. What situation? All unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay. At the farm. Oh, give me a fucking break. Are you gonna let her talk to me like that? It's been the rule for a reason, Colin. And Bigby knows it's for the best of the town. It keeps everybody out of trouble. And what if a Mundy does see me, huh? Caramba, I'm mano. a pig, not a mouse with a hat and a cane. They know what a pig Ela is. Tá certa. It's not the end of the world. If Snow says that's the way it's gotta be, that's the way it's gotta be. What? Are you vez. kidding me? If you would simply get a glamour. Get a glamour? With what money? You think I can work? I don't even have thumbs. Wolf's residence. That's rude. Oh, Buffkin, what is it? Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? Hmm. Narissa. Narissa? That broad from the pudding and pie? Yes. Apparently, she told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about. But that she'll only tell you. And what do you think that could be? Ah, uh, Bigby's got an admirer. You always do well with the, uh, disenfranchised. Ela saiba something coisa about essa, your prickly essa demeanor attracts him like a moth to a flame. She knows something. She's helped me a little with the case. 
Maybe she has something else. Maybe she does. I should get back to the business office. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. And I should probably change out of these clothes. Consider ah, the discussion tabled, but not over. <laughs> tá cheia de sangue. Let me know when you're done with Nerissa. Aye, aye, Captain. She's a piece of work. Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? Eu não vou mandar o Colin I mean, pra fazenda. She seemed real serious about it, but I can still hang out here. Eu não faria right? isso com você, Colin. Look, uh, maybe a few will get sent up, but you're my friend, Colin. I wouldn't do that to you. Don't worry about it. Thanks, Bigby. Eu não quero mandar o Colin pra fazenda. Ele é o meu único amigo. Essa é a The Farm ali no quadro ali. É pra onde vão as fábulas que não conseguem se encaixar na sociedade. Que não tem glamour pra poder virar, virar um ser humano, essas coisas. Você devia ver os outros caras. If I came by. Don't be fooled by this. I didn't get the worst of it. Vai fumar, maluco? Todo machucado vai fumar. Huffin puffs. Not many people smoke those. Crane queria so what was that back there with Crane? He wanted you to tell me something. You know, it's not too late to talk. There's not a lot that I can talk about. You know that. So that spell Crane was trying to break. It's not just while you're at work, huh? What I mean is, I don't want to waste your time, but I don't want you wasting your own time either. Back in the dressing room, at the pudding and pie, I told you what I was looking for, and you found a way to tell me. You sent me to the open arms. Maybe that'll work again? You can try. I just... Go ahead. Uh... It might work. Armaram pro Crane? Crane wasn't the murderer. The open arms was a setup. You sent me there. Was there someone else you wanted me to find there? These lips are sealed. If I could answer you just like that, I wouldn't have had to make that appointment with you. No, I guess not. Sometimes, we have to find our way through life on our own, grasping and fumbling in the dark. I... I used to have friends to help me find my way, but now they're gone, and I don't know what to do. Uh, você pode confiar em mim. Is this making any sense? Are you saying you need a friend right now? You can trust me. 
What I'm saying is friends matter. And I... I don't have any left. Ela perdeu as duas amigas so dela. Ela perdeu a Faith e a Lily. Coitada, mano. Are you? Uh... Look around you. Meus amigos estão em perigo? Who are you talking about? Are my friends in danger? <sighs> I'm sorry. I thought I could do this. I need you to know I want to help, but but Fala. It's okay. Leva o Take tempo que precisar. Time. I'm sorry if I'm wasting your time. I thought I knew how to say it. Ribbons. Faith wore one too. Huh? Do you like it? Hmm. Do you? Não é sobre aparência. It's not how it looks that concerns me. It's what it does. <clears throat> That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? Ele já descobriu o feitiço. É no pescoço delas essa fita aí. Tem alguma maneira de quebrar o feitiço? That spell Crane talked about. Is there any way to break it? Is there something I can do about it? No! The lips are sealed! What? You can't! Just stay back! You can't! Do that. Slow down. It's all right. I'm not gonna do anything. Please, don't. Caramba! Caramba, ela ficou com medo. Okay, I get it. So the ribbons. Ainda bem que eu não toquei na fita dela, né? Senão. Ah, vou confortar ela, coitada. That's probably snow. Listen, Sheriff. Can you keep this conversation between us? I could be in a lot of trouble. Uh, I shouldn't be talking to you. Talvez eu tenha que falar com Snow. Please. I'm gonna have to tell Snow. She has to know about the ribbons. If you have to, just don't tell anyone else. <laughs> Sorry, I just need to talk to the sheriff for a moment. Please excuse us. One minute. I might have a new lead for you, but I don't know how solid it is. Beauty and Beast called the office just now. They said they wanted to talk to you about something. I wonder if they've heard about Crane. Thank you for listening, Sheriff. You should go on to your next business. I don't think you'll be wasting your time. Uh, wait, you don't have to go. Hum. Ela me deu uma dica. That was abrupt. It's one way to send a message. What did she tell you? I didn't mean to rush her out. Did you get anything from her? Ela me disse suficiente. A magia impede ela de really falar. Say anything. The magic that Crane was talking about. It's in the ribbon. And you can't take the ribbon off. Or... It's how Faith and Lily died. Ah. Então, okay then. Good o Big B já descobriu se tirar a fita elas morrem. So about Beauty and Beast, do you think there's something to it? Is this the right place to look? What could they know about the Crooked Man? Or do you think they just heard about last night? A Nerissa, a Nerissa apontou para lá. What's been going on? That's what Nerissa was doing, telling us to go there. I think she made it as clear as she could have. Hmm. You know, Beauty came to me a while back. She was looking for financial assistance. I told her there was nothing I could do, and and she said that meant she'd have to go somewhere else. Bigby, 
You don't think she meant that she was going to go to the Crooked Man, do you? That would explain why they called. We need to solve this before something else happens. Who knows what? I have other matters to attend to. Caramba! Vamos lá falar com a Bela e o Fera. Eu vou bater. Eles estão brigando. Oh, what do you want? Vocês ligaram, porra? You're just going around knocking on doors, stirring the pot. You called, right? Or uh, was it Beauty? Why would I call you? Listen, I've had a shitty night. Do you think you're the only one? And I really don't want to deal with the runaround. Snow said you called and wanted to talk to me. Well, I didn't call. Must have been Beauty. She's been surprising me a lot lately. Can I... So have you, Bigby. Yet, with all the sneaking around and secrets, somehow I'm still the bad guy in this. I've had to hear about it all night long from her. You got a shot? Who is it? Who's there? Beast? Me chama pra entrar aí, maluco. Are you gonna let me in or what? It's your pal, Big B. Hi, Big B. Please excuse us for just a minute. Can I talk to you in private? Yes, let's. Ele ainda tá machucado da briga que a gente teve. <risos> Ai, cara. Hmm. I guess I really do have the smallest apartment in the woodlands. I can already tell you're going to make a problem out of this. What's he doing here? We don't need to bring him into this. Beast. I just don't think we can trust him. Not after the way he went behind my back. And then you run and Caramba, run mano, olha o quadro. Hmm. Trust him. Talk about living in the past. For you. It was one little thing. Do you want to keep fighting about that? Or do you want to try to sort this out? Ah, na da história da Bela e a Fera, os móveis falam, né? And answer. É por isso que o Big B tá batendo nos móveis. I know what the electric bill is for that thing. Later. Sorry, it's been a long night. Yeah, you know what they say. Centuries of marriage come with centuries of baggage. I gotta say, your place, it looks, uh, expensive. What do you mean by that? Beast! No, really, I wanna know. What are you trying to say, huh? Did you come to give us decorating tips? You've lived here a long time, and you've never called me over. So what's this about? Snow told me you went to her for some financial help. Did you end up going to the Crooked Man? I didn't know what else to do, so... We should deal with this on our own. Bigby's just going to complicate things. I called him here, and I want to see if he can help us out. Why are you being like this? I'm just trying to do what's best for us. No desperdiço meu tempo, no, man. Look, I'm not here to referee. You called me, okay? So cut the bullshit and quit wasting my time. I gotta know one thing first. What if we did have something to say about the Crooked Man? What if we talk and you don't get it? And all this comes back on us? We'd be risking a lot. We've seen what happens when you cross the Crooked Man. And I don't know if it's worth it. If you can't give us outras pessoas em perigo também. We're just looking for a little peace of mind in this. You think you're the only ones in danger? If you have info on that Crooked Bastard, I need to hear it. Otherwise, I've got better things to do. No, please don't. Then tell me what the fuck is going on. You're in so much debt? Look around you. This isn't the way people short on cash live. Look, we're used to a certain kind of lifestyle, okay? We couldn't just give that up. We never meant for it to get like this. It's just that we had nowhere else to turn, and we got in over our heads. There's not a lot of work out there. Who would we be if we just lived like... Hi there, you've reached Beauty. And Beast. And we're out doing something. 
Hum, quem é que tá ligando? Uh, let me just step. A day at the beach? Skiing the slopes? <laughs> hey, we can't come to the phone right now, so leave I a should... message you as soon as... <laughs> Ih, mano, é alguém ligando. Alguém importante. De quem é essa voz? Who is that? The crooked man's gonna get his, one way or another. Quem é esse? Tava ameaçando os dois, mano. All I care about is how can I find the crooked man? Who do I talk to? Where do I go? The lucky pawn. That's where I borrowed the money. The crooked man's behind that place. I'd overheard people talking to Jersey about loans before. So when I needed money, that's where Quem I went. É Jersey, mano? I didn't know what to do. Quem é Jersey? You could have told me. You had enough on your plate. Wait, who do you deal with? Jersey. You know, the Jersey Devil. O demônio oh, de yeah. Jersey. That slimy prick. I didn't realize he was back on this side of the river. And those tweedles were always going in and out. Probably dropping off a loan payment they squeezed out of some poor fable. But never the crooked man. Mainly it's just regular fables. I can see now that it was a mistake, but I'm not the only one who goes there, you know. I saw the woodsman's axe there just the other day. It was in a display case. I guess he's hit hard times too. There's a lot of that going around. I can't imagine he has a lot of marketable skills. Sometimes fables just don't have anywhere else to go. Por que que você What iria the hell are you doing hanging out at a place like the Lucky Pawn anyway? Sometimes fables sell things they brought from the homelands. Things you can't find anywhere else. You do know there's a difference between pawning something and selling it, don't you? I... I know that. You're buying a piece of someone else's misery. With money. You don't have. Well, that's over now. Caramba, Maybe mano. if you go there, you can sort some Será things que ela out. Vendeu os móveis falantes I guess I'll go tinha. check out the Lucky Pawn. If I can't track down the Crooked Man there, maybe I can make enough noise that the Crooked Man will come find me. Hold on, Bigby. Don't go there. Sounds like you're just going to get Beauty in trouble. And... You know that butcher shop? The cut above. It's the place on Tubman Street. Same block as the baker and the candlestick maker. Well, I've been delivering packages from there for a while. The thing is, it's for the crooked man. And I don't think it's meat in the packages. You, you gotta understand, I needed work. You have to believe us. We didn't think it would get like uh, this. King Tregas Oasis. Well, what are you delivering? What's going on there? How does this fit into the crooked man's operation? I couldn't tell you, but I do know this. It's the only meat market in town that doesn't carry filet. I'm not sure how much actual butchery goes on there. How did you get involved with this? Johan the butcher called. He had a problem with the refrigeration unit one night. But when I finished, it was your pal Mary who showed up to pay me. She said I was reliable. She liked that. It's the only thing I've been able to pick up, and it's still not enough. I don't want Beauty to have to work, Essa Mary tá sempre lá. not where she was. It's up to me to take care of her. It's Mary you deal with? Bloody Mary is there? No, Johan is the one who hands over the packages, you know, day to day. But I've seen her around there. She uh, gets under my skin, you know, I, I try to avoid her. But I don't need to tell you what she's You're like. damn right you don't. I don't need a rundown on her reputation. If Mary works out of there, I need to look into it. I just wanted to provide for beauty. Give her the kind of life she deserves. We shouldn't have to live like this. Scraping to get by. None of us should. 
We were royalty once. We were accustomed to a certain lifestyle. All we want is to make this place feel a little bit like home. You wouldn't understand, Big B. Uh, não preciso entender nada, não. I don't need to understand. It's not my fucking job to understand. My job is to keep Fable Town safe. So, where are you going? If this all goes sideways, I'd like to know where it's coming from. Cara, pra onde eu vou? Uh, Lucky Palm ou Butcher Shop? Uh, coisas antigas. Vamos na, vamos na loja de penhores. Essa Lucky Palm. I'm going to the Lucky Palm. There's too much going on there to ignore. I'll have a word or two with Jersey. You know, Bigby, once you show your face there, word is going to get out. There may be nothing left to see if you go to the butcher shop after. Well, I guess I'll find out. É, mano. Eu vou para essa tal loja de penhores, todo mundo vai ficar sabendo. Wait. I don't know what you're planning to do when you find the crooked man, but is there any way you could help us out? Caramba, que cara. What do you mean? Well, maybe you can make this all just go away. We would really appreciate it. What do you say? Can you help us out? I don't go around fixing debts. Lucky for you, what I am gonna do might just fix it anyway. Just keep us in mind, please. I'm sure you'll do the right thing. Caramba, mano. Eles fizeram merda e ainda queriam que eu consertasse as dívidas deles. Now it's not. It looks like you slept in it. In a pile of garbage. Jack, why are you... I've seen you take a torn purse for a tenner. Yeah, but I also got her phone number. I don't want your phone number. Ugh, really? Hmm, então é aqui que o Jack vende as coisas. Cadê seu glamour, sapo? This is a surprise. Sheriff, why are you never glamour, Toad? Why is it so hard to just follow the rules? Look, I know some fables can switch from man to beast and back again, like changing shirts. But it's not so easy for the rest of us to look human, all right? And anyways, I'm getting the money right now. I'm not taking the coat. But it's magic. So? And it'll be covering a check I already wrote. Okay, well, that sounds like a your problem problem Is that casaco da yeah, face? Yeah, it is. And so I came here to sell it off. Why would you think I'd take an ugly used Vai mule embora skin antes que eu leve embora o casaco. it's magic mule skin, that's why. Jack said he doesn't want the coat. So it's time to go, Toad. Move along before I confiscate it. Whoa, if it's even on the business office's radar. I want no part of it. No sale. Good night, Irene. You blasted coward. Thanks for nothing, Sheriff. Posing on the common man he is. Wouldn't be so tough if he wasn't a sheriff. He didn't have a teeth for the claws. Cara, o, toad, or... o sapo oh, nunca tá usando glamour, ele. Be out like this, <laughs> can't you at least ele wear vai a andar, bigger ele hat? Ele vai andar na rua assim. Have a good day. Drop by any time. Desculpa. Look, I'm sorry, all right? What else do you want from me? He really grows on you. Look, então, o Jack I told you I work here, here and loja, I do, né? okay? So don't look so surprised. Bloody Mary works for the Crooked Man. And the last time I saw her, she had the Woodsman's axe. So? So the last time anybody else saw that axe, it was here. We'd never take something like that. Is this really why you came down here? The Woodsman's mm. axe? Because I don't know anything about perguntas. it. I'll be asking the questions here, Jack. Okay, fine. Fire away. Because I'm not a mind reader. And unless it's Barker or the other, machado. I don't think I can help much anyway. There's more than just pawning going on here. You got the loans. What else? Maybe it's like a weapons locker too. O machado do lenhador. Was the axe here? No. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I think I'd notice a giant mystical axe. And that's saying something. 
Since, you know, I can sometimes miss the obvious. I'm just joking. A bela I never falou miss anything. Tá... Eu não vou falar, Steel trap and all that. Eu vou you wouldn't mind if I look around for a bit, then. And what if I did mind? Uh, got it. Listen, I gotta start closing up shop, so, uh... Close? It's the middle of the day. What can I say? Jersey likes to run at odd hours. And really, he'd be the one to talk to, so... Can't you just swing by later? It really wouldn't be good for me if he sees your face when he walks mm, in. Fala so, sobre uh, Jersey. I'd really rather you not physically be here if he comes back. You know? What else can you tell me about Jersey Devil? Just that he's a fucking psycho and I like to stay out of his way. I typically work when he's not here. But I can call you when he comes back, all right? Can't you Shut just... up, Jack. If the Jersey Devil isn't here to answer my questions, it also means he isn't here to get in my way. So I'm gonna take a look around, as long as I've got the elbow room. All right. Don't let me get in your way. I won't. Ah, vamos olhar em volta. Deve ter um monte de artefato mágico aqui. What's the anvil for? Blacksmith didn't need it. I haven't seen him around for a while. Uma bola de cristal. Tá rachada. Tá rachada. Tá com 50% de desconto porque tá rachada. <risos> Isn't this from Crane's apartment? Ele roubou a estátua Maybe? do Crane. You didn't go back over there and swipe it. I swear on Toad's life. <risos> a jura pela vida do sapo. E mano, a adaga do Prince is Lawrence. Lawrence's dagger. Who sold this? I don't know. Look, are you almost done? A dagger isn't exactly the axe, so, uh, who cares, really? Who would have done that? One of the Tweedles? Foi um Whoever dos... did it must have needed the money bad, which shouldn't come as a total shock. Cara, quem foi que vendeu a daga do Príncipe Lawrence? Ele tava morto. Habit, do you? You, and Grin, and Toad, you're all better off than you think. It was a rhetorical question, but sure, fine. Caramba, mano. Um trofe... uma... uma taça. Aquisição recente. Ah, tá faltando um item aqui, hein? Machado do Lenhador. I thought you said you'd never take something like this. Uh, uh... Você What? mentiu pra mim I, I quando I Mary uh... tava aqui. <risos> Jack? Uh, yeah? When was Mary here? Was who here? Bloody Mary. Because the axe was here. But it's gone. And she had it. So she was here. I don't know anything about that. I don't. Really. I mean, I don't work every day. So, uh... And even when I do work, Eu I just try to keep my head down. Just tell me the truth. What happened to the axe? It was Mary. She took it, okay? That's all I know. That's all you know? You don't know she almost fucking killed me with it last night? No. No. I had no goddamn idea. She sometimes comes in to pick up shit. Sometimes it's for her. Sometimes it's for the crooked man. But I'm smart enough mm, to not ask questions, coisa. all right? She say anything about... About the crooked man's plans. About Crane? What? You think we're friends? I try not to even look that crazy chick in the eye. Well, for your sake, you better think of something to tell me. That's all I can tell you. I'm being straight here. I'm just part-time. I mean, it's Jersey who's the one who's into this stuff. He's one of the crooked man's boys, okay? And it'd be great if he was here to tell you all this, but he's not. So just... Jersey, don't... Don't give me that shit. What the fuck is the point of having a system? Eee, Leandro! That's my fucking system. But you... You're the guy who makes sure I'm the guy to keep shit in order, and that's it, Woody. E fudeu. Close the fucking gate. Jack? If you love your axe so fucking much, why'd you pawn it in the first fucking place, huh? I didn't pawn it, asshole. It was stolen from my apartment. And Grant said that he saw it here. Now tell me where it is right fucking now. I think while tempers are running high, Relaxa we should aí, keep Leandro. demands to a minimum. Woody, calm down. Your axe isn't here. Christ. And this fucking guy, too? Bigby? What? It isn't? Nope. It isn't. Just like I said, it's not here. Happy? 
I got shit. Então não foi so o Leandro que, here, que penhorou o machado dele, roubaram dele. Uh, he wanted to know where. Actually, you know what? I don't care what he wants. Eu tenho perguntas para você. We're not finished yet. Yes, we are. You work with the crooked man. Until I give you permission, you're not gonna do anything but answer my questions. Uh, how's your arm? Bloody Mary leaves a bit of a stink, don't she? Jack, did you know that as of this very morning, Bigby's joined the crooked man's obedience school for wayward fucking creatures? He's already passed his first class. You see, the sheriff had who he stupidly thought was the murderer. Been chasing him for fucking days, right? But the crooked man snapped his bony fingers and Bigby handed him over just like that. I'm uh, just gonna uh, let you know. Não two. foi assim que aconteceu. Yeah. The crooked man appreciated that. I wouldn't exactly put it like that. Are you kidding me? It was here. It was right fucking here. What did you do with it? How the fuck do I know? Listen, you bald little dipshit. You're gonna... You piece of shit. God, I... If we'll see you Jersey. I'm gonna rip your fucking lungs out. Back it up, Jersey. You're dealing with me now. I didn't expect to see you upright. Still looking for whoever killed them hookers? Or are you done chasing your tail? Where's my axe? Who'd you give it to? You follow me here all the way from Battery Fucking Park? Just so I can prove to you that your axe is in Side here? Here, and you think I'm gonna take another inch of abuse? Hey, back off and settle down. Oh, what the fuck are you gonna do? You talk big. But I don't think you got the stones to back it up. God, Still a little sore, are we? Why should Mary get all the fun? Ele é you ain't so tough. Vai rolar a briga. Vai tomar. Agulha. Agulha na cara. O que você está This is my fucking fight. Not Leandro. now, dog. You got a lot of nerve. Oh shit! Se transformou. Chega, né? Caramba, cara. A gente virou lobo mais ou menos, né? Um pouquinho. Viramos lobo nível 1. Vou perguntar as coisas pra ele. So, wanna try again? You can't find a crooked man. No one can. There's no address. No place. He lives in the bends and forks of tree roots, behind the sun, in the <coughs> shadows. 
That's not good enough. Oh, the door to his house. It bounces around. Never in one spot. You'll never find it. Even Crane had to use the magic mirror. That fucking guy. <laughs> oh, mm. mirror, mirror. Oh, Como você entra em contato com ele? Shit. Okay, that's Crane's way. How do you contact him? Oh, I don't. He uses couriers for everything. Ravens, oh, goblins, the fucking Tweedles. Whatever. I go in when I'm taken there. You don't know anything about anything, do you? What do you have? Nothing. Had ah, useless bitch Snow White in a broken fucking mirror. No Como fucking você sabe que o espelho tá quebrado? No about who was really running this town. Where did you hear it got broken? Oh, that. Gossip flies fast. Ah. We're like a sewing circle. It doesn't matter what you fucking do. You're not gonna get him. You wanna knock on his fucking door and see what happens? Fine. Crane had the mirror. Bloody Mary had Crane. So take your fucking wrecking crew act to the butcher shop. The cut above. And if I can find the mirror piece there, I can find the crooked man. That's her spot. That's where all the magic happens. Now leave me. So I can find some aspirin. <risos> Aspirina. Ah, mano. Se estiver mentindo, eu vou voltar. You better not be fucking with me. I'll come back here and finish the job. You got what you want. Now get the fuck out of here. Hey, Sheriff. Those girls are still dead. Oh, and there's nothing you ah, can do to bring them back. Meninas, né? And I don't know what they did, but I do know this. Oh, if they're dead, it's because the crooked man wanted them dead. That's all it takes. So you can raw smash the place up. <laughs> Shit. You can wail on me all you want. But what good is it going to do? Because he ain't in your town. You're in his. And he sure as shit is ready for you. Beleza. Esse tal Crooked Man é o manda, é o manda chuva do submundo, né? Dá um cigarro pro Woody. Eu vou dar um cigarro pra ele. Vou ser legal com ele. Goody brand. You're welcome. Eles gostam do mesmo cigarro e <laughs> ou I'm ele fez uma lie. piada. I was having trouble deciding which one of you to hit with this thing. Jersey was wrong, you know. About what? About those girls. There is something. And get the fucker who did it. Ain't that the plan? É o que eu vou fazer. Yeah. Eu vou pegar right o cara que matou as meninas. All right. Go do it then. Hmm. A gente se vê. <laughs> hey Woody. Yeah. I'll see you around, all right? Yeah. I'll see ya. Beleza. Cara, o lenhador é muito grande, né? E ainda tem um machado que com certeza é mágico e mata mata qualquer bicho da, desse lugar aqui. Não sei se vocês repararam durante a briga. Um, a arma que a Blood Mary atirou em mim tava lá na loja de penhores também.
Uh, parar de fumar? Eu vou continuar fumando. Eu já apanhei. Eu já tô todo sujo. Foda-se. Não tem ninguém atendendo. Eu vou continuar fumando. Nossa, mas não tem nada nesse açougue aqui. É um açougue de mentira isso aqui? Huh, empty. Either he's got a whole lot of customers, or he doesn't have any. Right. Carne congelada. Tem pouca carne aqui, hein? Not very appetizing. E umas carne ruim, né? Dá para ver que. Solid. Who'd want to eat this? Dá para ver que tá extremamente congelado e, e tá tipo pedra de gelo, estragada já. Ah, um açougueiro. E aí? Big B Wolf? Ih, se assustou comigo. Me atende aí. What happened to you? I'm looking for a piece of the magic mirror. Um, what? The magic hum, mirror is missing Bibi. shard. Where is it? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? What? B Bloody Mary? Magic mirror shard? <laughs> What kind of place do you think this is? Don't bullshit me. I'm not. What you're looking for, I... I think you'd be better off looking at uh, the Lucky Pond. Yeah, or someplace like that. You know where it is, right? It's around the corner and a few blocks down. Eu já tive I'll lá. bet you get lucky there. <laughs> Eu já tive lá na loja I, de I, I guess that's why já. they call it. Yeah. I've been there. I didn't find what I was looking for. I had some words with Jersey, too. Words? Anyway, if, if I'd have known you already looked at the Lucky Pawn, I, I, I wouldn't have pointed you there. I, I just figured anything worth a damn in Fable Town goes through Jersey's hands at some point. You know that. Believe me, I don't want to waste your time, Sheriff. And I certainly don't mean to offend. Eu quase I don't matei know how to Jersey. <laughs> yeah, well, Jersey had those dirty hands wrapped around my neck not too long ago. Oh, sorry. It's okay. I smashed his horse face in, knocked some teeth out. He won't be chewing bubblegum anytime soon. Listen, Crane had the mirror, Mary had Crane, and she comes around here, right? If you're covering for her, I'm gonna have a problem with you. So you better think real hard about what you say next. I... Sheriff, I... Did you hear that? Ah, vai tentar fugir. Oh, I'm real sorry. Hold on. I, I just got to go check on Vai tentar that. fugir. Don't go anywhere. I'll be Ele right apertou back. o botão vermelho ali. I just have to go see. Filho da mãe, cara. Vamos, vamos passar aqui. Shit. O merdinha tentou fugir. I got it covered back here, Sheriff. I'll be right out. Cara, eu não vou falar nada. Eu não vou falar nada. Eu vou deixar, eu vou ficar em silêncio. I'm sorry, sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, safety purposes. Come on, damn it. Vou ficar quieto. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. They're gonna kill me. Oh god, she is gonna fucking kill me. He's gonna get me killed. Uh, vou bater no ombro dele. <laughs> Things I do. How you doing? Please, please, Bigby. Please don't. Bigby? What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. I don't want to die. Please. Please don't kill me. Se acalma. Please don't kill me. Acalma, homem. Listen, 
Just calm the fuck down, okay? I just want some answers. I'm not built like the Jersey Devil. Whatever you did to him, I can't take that. I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you can keep your life and lose your shop, or lose both. What would you do? It was a simple choice to make in the moment. Easy, even when they got down the the deep freeze. Just open the door, Johan. It won't be your problem anymore. I, I can't. Why not? What's back there? I don't know. I honest. I I've never been back there. It's locked from the other side. Look, I, I just worked the front. That's all I'm supposed to do. I've I've actually I haven't been back there in years. Toma. Why are you doing this? I'm not part of their crew. Abri. Crew. Fuck. The crooked man's people. Jersey Devil, D and Dumb, and that mental case Bloody Mary. Y you want to talk about the real butcher? <laughs> It's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All cause of that heat wave. This summer fall. was even hotter than this one. Oh, I let Mary and those porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. I'm just a victim in this. I don't know what they do back there. I swear, a and I don't want to know. I'm not allowed to. Eu acredito nele. It's all right. I believe. Ele é um covarde. Calm down. Eu quero saber o que tem atrás da porta. I knew this would happen. Didn't know when. There would be the day. Shh. What será que tem aqui? Um laboratório. Um laboratório. Is this place? I told you, Big P. I don't know. They muscled me out. I swear, I don't know anything more. I haven't been back here when it was like this. Warning lights. Ah, ele avisou para alguém. It's business. It's all I've ever had. Você I guess that's why I stuck around. Eu podia ter lidado com eles. I get why you flipped that switch, but you had a choice. You could have told me. And warn them, I might be dealing with your problem right now. Told you. Huh. You come in here making trouble for me. But you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes or something. Where were you when they took this place from me? It hasn't been easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? I needed Eu vou help. Consertar isso. I needed your help. Well, I'm here Eu vou now. Gonna sort this all out. Ah, é aqui que eles fabricam o negócio. So this is what Beast was delivering. Glamours, other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. É aqui que eles fabricam os glamours, é aqui que eles fabricam That symbol. It's on all the packages. What is it? That's the crooked man's uh brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. So you do know something, huh? Is that a, a wheel or what? I guess they never used that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed to mean? It's from back in the homelands. A torture device. It came over here with the rest of our stories. Not that Mondays need any help coming up with that kind of thing. It makes people crooked. By breaking their bones and... Do I really need to explain this? Hmm. Que que tem aqui nesse quadro? Too bad they had time to erase it all. This could have been useful. Eles apagaram tudo que o maluco avisou. 
Tá, tem um negócio ali atrás, mas deixa eu olhar aqui as coisas. These are raw materials for making magic. Anti Greenleaf and any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Ah. Maybe just don't touch anything back here, please. Nossa, tem uma, umas paradas acontecendo dentro desse caldeirão, a magia louca ali, né? What are they making here? I'm just a butcher. You want to talk T-bones? <laughs> That I can do. This stuff is out of my league. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. E essas correntes aqui, cara? Chains. Who's getting chained up here? You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. Caramba, será que ele acorrenta as pessoas que trabalham aqui? Is this what those loans get you? That crooked piece of shit. Ribbons, chains, it's it's all the fucking same. Será que as pessoas que trabalham aqui são acorrentadas todas elas? De quem é esse casaco aqui? I know this isn't your coat. What's it doing here? It's a coat. What's the big deal about some dirty Looks like cranes. It's seen some abuse. Oh. I'm sure he handled it just fine. O crane apanhou, mano. É do crane. No time for traveler's checks, huh? O dinheiro dele. Eu pego o dinheiro ou deixo? Ah, vou deixar, vai, fica aí, vai. Não vou roubar. Não vou, não sou ladrão. <risos> Uma foto da mulher. Foto da Snow. Um pedaço do espelho. Eu tive sorte, hein? Hey, hold on. I told you what I knew. And look what you did to me. You're just as fucked up as they are. You really still are the big Eu bad bati em você, maluco. Is this what you do? You just go around ruining fables lives, tormenting people. You should have just stayed home. Spent the day você chain pediu. smoking. Don't play innocent with me, butcher. You screwed with me up front. Don't cry foul because you got it in the end. What the hell am I supposed to do now? I'm gonna have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for blood. A gente Mary. vai te proteger. You won't care a gente vai I achar um jeito. My end. Report to the business office. Tell Snow I sent you there, and we'll uh, we'll figure something out. Some kind of protection. You're going to protect me. Sim, eu vou te proteger. Eu te deixei com o olho roxo, mas eu te protejo. <laughs> Maluco. Eu devia ter mexido num quadro ali, galera. Tinha um quadro ali pra gente olhar. Bom, a gente achou um pedaço do espelho. Já dá pra achar o Crooked Man. Já dá pra achar a Bloody Mary. Já dá pra achar muita gente. Dá pra achar o Crane agora com um pedaço do espelho. I don't care who killed the prostitutes. Crane was helping himself to the community coffers. It means his hand was in my pocket, and you just let him go. I don't know what you heard, but it didn't happen like that. Are you denying the facts? Uh, she's denying me the chance to get a word in. Now, Miss White, I... Sheriff Bigby has returned. Ah, oh, there's the old wrecking bowl himself. Bigby, where have you been? I'm not finished here, Miss White. You will have to wait. <sighs> just one moment, please. Look what I found. Seems your dog wants a biscuit. I'm not in the mood. And you've got a lot to answer for. Oh, really? Buffkin, get this piece in the mirror right away. With pleasure, Miss White. <sighs> Finally, things are swinging back in the right direction. Good work, Oh, macaco não tem altura para colocar you've aquele been espelho, gone né? All day. What did you uncover? I thought you were going to report back to me. I mean, Toda it's fable fine. Town tá envolvida. So what else did you find out? I gotta say, this thing reaches a lot further than we thought. The crooked man has something on everybody. It wasn't just beauty and the loan. Beast was working for him. His goon, the Jersey Devil, is putting the squeeze on all kinds of fables down at the Lucky Pawn. He was even running...
black market magic out of the butcher shop. But that's over now, because we got the mirror. And once it's fixed, we got him. That's how Crane did it. That's how we're gonna do it. Excellent work. Really. Sheriff, I could use your assistance. Would you join me at the mirror? Don't go far, Sheriff. I'd like to have a few words of my own with you. I mm. believe the you Flycatcher. Why'd you put the hurt on Flycatcher? Were you hiding something down at the Tweedles? Or was it just for fun? He worked for them, didn't he? I couldn't be sure that he wasn't involved. And I didn't want him interfering. I was simply endeavoring to make the search a speedy one. Surely you of all people ele can't no, fault no me for getting overzealous in the process. Bava. I don't buy it. No escritório dos Tweedles. I have more important things to deal with right now. You can be sure that we're gonna have a long fucking talk about this when I'm done. I do so enjoy our talks. I'll wait with bated breath. I don't understand. This piece just doesn't want to join the rest. Do you have any idea why? You got me. Well, where did you find it? What has it gone through since being separated from the rest? Shattering is a very traumatic experience, you know. So this process can be a little touchy. It helps that I have a good working relationship And I don't mind speaking in rhyme. I found it in Crane's coat. Last person I saw with Crane or his coat was that psycho Bloody Mary. Maybe she had some... Ah, yes, Miss White was asking about her. That explains it. You know who and the mirror have a very unhappy history with each other. How would you like it if she tried to use you as a doorway? I think I already know the feeling. Well, I think I know how to proceed now. It will just take a little extra coaxing, that's all. Thank you for your help. It could be a while, Sheriff. I'll find you when it's ready. Besides which, he might not want to come out with you watching. Oh, he doesn't like being spied on. If you ask me, you're everything that's okay, is this is it fixed? Did you ask about the crooked man? Fuskin's still working on it. He said it might be a while. If you're so self-reliant, what do you want from the business office so bad? What I want is my business. I can't take those two right now. We're trying to catch a murderer, and they're... They're over there bickering about bureaucracy. We're at war. Don't they realize that? O italiano e o sapo italiano... É muito engraçado, né? But just so you know, we can't pay him. He really needs to go to the farm, you know. So, just break the news and be done with it, okay? Cara, eu não quero que o Toad vá pra farm. Toad, come here. I thought I made myself very clear. I see how it is. Passed off to an underling, eh? Why am I not surprised? Well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh to cover it. I tried talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall, it is. Now I'm sure you've got your own agenda, Sheriff, but I've taken a real wallet because of you, and you can't deny that. I'm starting to think you don't take me seriously, Toad. How many times have I told you to get glamoured up? You know that if you're out of glamour, I gotta send you to the farm. Well, how about your friend the pig, hmm? Is he going to the farm too? Yeah, you thought we didn't know about him, huh? A worse kept secret in fable town. For a friend, the rules will bend. I just think it's not bad. Vistas. Colin stays out of sight. Colin so fica Mark no hotel. Can you say the same? Oh, fine, fine, I get that. But might I propose a very simple solution? If you give me one more chance and hear me out, I see a way for me and me boy to stay. I'm not gonna ask for any more than I need. I just want to stay. So what do you say? You just give me enough to cover me glamours, and we'll call the rest to watch. Será que eu tenho dinheiro para dar para ele? Don't take TJ from the only army knows. This old glamour rule is oppressive. I've done nothing wrong, but look different. You know, it's not right. Eu vou fazer o que eu posso para ajudar. This world isn't kind to those of us who can't pass for human. Look, I'll try to get you that money and get you another chance, but you have to understand, it's not entirely up to me. Oh, thank you, Sheriff. 
Eu vou ajudar o Toad porque ele é... É um bom pai, tá ligado? Tipo, o filho dele é um menino inteligente. E ele ficou todo feliz também. Deu até pulinho. Ah, ela não vai gostar de eu ter ajudado ele. Bear, you wanna talk? Now's your chance. I've just made my donation funding this office. So direct your questions to Miss White. Caramba, ele foi embora, o cara não quer falar comigo. Well, at least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not. For now. Did you take care of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important right now, but glamours are the law for a very good reason. You know that as well. Ele não vai ser um problema. Toad won't be a problem. I'll see to that. Are you sure? Because he left looking pretty happy. <laughs> Fine. We'll deal with it later. I know I should be asking how it got like this. Ele saiu bem I just felizinho, keep wondering né? why it happened to Faith and Lily. You've seen his world. Do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? I don't know if the crooked man killed them with his own hand or if it was one of his é goons. Sobre controle, né? Someone did. Ele quer controlar a Fable Town. If there's one thing I figured out, it's that the crooked man is all about control. It's what he does with the loans at the pawn shop, the magic he peddles, chains, ribbons. Maybe Faith and Lily weren't doing what they were told, or maybe they just tried to leave. Sheriff, Miss White, I believe the mirror is repaired. Hum, o maluco consertou os, o macaquinho consertou isso. I have to say, I have been better. But thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry. I just I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. Hum, a rima dela foi boa. <laughs> yeah. I want to see where he's ended up to. Cadê o crane? Será que ele tá vivo? You will get on that plane to Paris and you will wait for the day the crooked man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, Caramba. I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. Ela tá vendo. Ela sabe. What just happened? We pointed you in the wrong direction. Looked at Bloody Mary's reflection. Oh, her. That explains the sting. I'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings. So, let's not do that again, okay? Caramba! Like we'll track him down Ela tem controle right. sobre os espelhos também, né? We need né? to focus on the immediate threat, and that's the crooked man. Bigby, we don't have a lot of time. Are you having trouble with the rhyme, Sheriff? Just show me where I can find the crooked man. I haven't been feeling well of late. Seems neither of us can cooperate. Caramba, mano, não tem uma rima. Perhaps I can be of assistance? <coughs> mirror, mirror, keep us sane. Show the door to crooked man's domain. I can always count on you, Buffkin. I don't recognize the door, but... That's the crooked man symbol on it. Hold off. The door. É um portal. It moves. Ah, a porta yeah, fica indo de um lugar pro outro, that. mano. Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Bigby, wait. When you get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. We can't just dispense street justice. I know that emotions can run high, and you have your reasons ah, to handle mano. this a certain way. Tá, eu vou But we have to make a commitment no. to working within the law. I'll catch him and bring him back here, alive. Then we can clean him and cook him together. Good. I have enough to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. So I'm going to trust you to handle this properly. That is, if you think you're ready. Of course I'm ready. I got no other choice. Bora atrás dele. Será que a porta vai sumir? Ah, 
Abre! Chuta! É um portal, maluco! Que lugar é esse, cara? Sumiu, já era. Um ale... um... Quem é esse maluco? Tim, what the hell are you doing here? Good evening, Sheriff. Quem é esse cara? The boss. Thanks, by the way, for leaving off Tiny. Tiny Tim. You think I'd have outgrown that centuries ago? I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. I know you weren't here on a social call. Você estava me esperando. So thanks for not giving me a hard time. Hold on. You've just been waiting for me to show up? You knew I was coming? That's what they told me. I don't know, they said you made it pretty clear. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so if you'll come this way. Look, this is the one thing I have to do. Please don't make this hard on me. Tá bom, vou seguir você. I want to get in trouble. Will you just follow me? Fine, lead on. Que lugar é esse, mano? O castelo. Thanks for understanding. This is all I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard or an escort, for that matter. É perigoso para você aqui. I was aqui. a little surprised myself when they asked me to do it. I thought it was a joke, actually. You shouldn't be here, Tim. This place is dangerous, especially for someone like you. It's not like that. Whatever you may think of him, he doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He gave me a job, and I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe. Was I think I shall think the boss go up maluco. against each other? The rest of Fable Town is going to get caught in the middle. And if you're here, it can't be good. Tem que achar outro emprego. I understand the position you're in, but you don't have to do this. There are other things you could do. So it's just that easy. Maybe not, but you don't want to be a part of this. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. Hey, Sheriff, hold up. I gotta go in with you. Vou esperar ele. Can't you just wait up, Sheriff? Coitado, ele é calejado, vou esperar Thanks. ele. Thanks. <laughs> kind of fucking joke, you. What did I tell you, eh? Stop laughing at me. Você primeiro. Go ahead. You got a job to do. It's the wolf. Sheriff Wolf, sir. Ih, os caras que eu arrebentei. O Jersey. O Tweedle. Thank you, Tim. I know the sheriff isn't the accommodating sort, but you handled it. You did well. You can go now. Thank you, sir. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Ah, uh, I'll send you a cigarette. I'll send you a cigarette. <risos> ah, maluco Caramba Você mandou o Colin pra fazenda? A maioria não mandou uh, Tentou remover a fita da Nerissa uh, Eu e a maioria dos players Não tentou remover a fita uh, 
qual operação do Crooked Man eu investiguei primeiro? Nossa, só 36% das pessoas vão na loja de penhores? Uh, mandar o sapo pra fazenda? A maioria não manda. Como você respondeu ao Crooked Man? <risos> 43% acendeu um cigarro. <risos> Caramba, então a maioria é bacana com Crooked Man. Que droga. E bom, galera, esse foi o episódio 4 de The Wolf Among Us. Esse episódio foi muito bom. Ele teve uma luta ali no meio com o demônio de Jersey, que foi legal pra caramba. E a gente ficou meio brother do lenhador, né? Que não merece ser nosso inimigo, né? O cara é só um fracassado, tá ligado? É isso, galera. Vou encerrar por aqui. Falou.